Welcome to Cleo's Cooking. Today we're making Trinidad fried rice and here I have a pan on the stove which I'm going to add some boiling water to but I'm still going to allow it to even get more bubbly in the pan before I actually put the rice in. And then I'm going to move on to cutting up my vegetables for the rice and I'm just going to show you how I slice the carrots down before cutting them into julienne's pieces or sticks if you want to say and then I gather them in a heap and I chop them finely and that's the quickest way to do it by hand growing up I had to to cut, cut up the vegetables for the fried rice and it was a monotonous task so I've found a way over the years how to just do it as quickly as possible so now I'm adding my rice to the pan but I'm not going to add any salt because we will be using soy sauce later on and that has enough salt in it. So I'm doing the same thing with the spring onions. I'm just slicing them down the middle and then I'm going to gather them into a heap as well and I'm going to chop them finely and it's going to be pretty quick. So I'm continuing with my celery. So this is a very healthy rice because it has lots of vegetables in it. So if you're a vegetarian, you know, it's quite nice for you as well. So everything is cut into julienne pieces or matchstick pieces, if you want to say. And just look how I do the the garlic slice it down and then chop it finely and that one's done so slice it thinly again gather it all up and chop it thinly so I'm now just checking the rice to see how much more cooking it needs and I'm back to my sweet peppers which I'm chopping finely again Right, so all our vegetables are ready and our rice we can see that I'm crushing the grains between my thumb and index finger and now we have our pan with our sesame oil and our carrots and we just saute in it for a few minutes about two, about three minutes until they're nice and tender and then we're going to add in the celery stalks and the carrots Here we add in the celery stalks that we've chopped up. And now we're going to add in our garlic. I'm not sure if I said carrots twice, but we're adding our garlic now. I'm just going to let that saute again for a couple of minutes until that's a bit tender. And then we're going to add in our peppers. What we don't want to do is overcook the vegetables because it's not going to be nice if things are overcooked. We want them to retain some of the color. Here is some Chinese five spice, just a teaspoon of Chinese five spice that really adds flavor to the dish. Fried rice is very popular in Trinidad. Growing up, we we had to chop vegetables for it every single Saturday evening or Sunday morning just to prepare for making this rice. And we served it either with fried chicken, stewed chicken, or we had pork or beef, or roast chicken. The options were endless, but it almost was a must have within families. So here I'm adding my chopped spring onion at the very end because I don't want it to wilt too much. I'm just gonna mix that in and then we have our rice here nicely finished and we can see, still see the vibrant colors.